And now, Last Week Tonight asks, how is this still a thing? This week, Columbus Day. How is this still a thing? America has a lot of solemn holiday traditions. From saluting the quiet dignity of the Irish, to proudly celebrating our birth as a nation, to just spending quality time with family at Thanksgiving. But next week brings perhaps the strangest of American holidays, Columbus Day which brings with it the beloved annual traditions of cheesy local commercials. In 1492, Columbus sailed the ocean blue to celebrate Mattress Depot. And Americans turning up to an unexpectedly closed post office and going, oh yeah, it's Columbus Day, shit. This proud holiday commemorates the landing of Christopher Columbus in the Bahamas in 1492, beginning a long tradition of obnoxious white people visiting Caribbean islands and acting like they own the place. In school, American children learn about Christopher Columbus's life. I will discover a shortcut to India. We'll call this part of India San Salvador. Of course, what they tend not to learn are the parts of Columbus's life where he kidnapped Native Americans and sold them into slavery, had his men slice them to pieces, and through disease and warfare killed roughly half the population of Haiti. But in fairness, none of that rhymes with in 1492. <laughs> Nevertheless, Columbus became famous for his discoveries, specifically the discovery that you can discover a continent with millions of people already living on it that had also been visited by Vikings around 500 years earlier. In fact, many U.S. states and cities no longer recognize Columbus Day, raising the question, why do the rest of us still do it? Sure, it's a chance for Italians to celebrate their heritage, but there are so many other heroes they could celebrate. Why not Frank Sinatra Day? He killed no Native Americans that we know of. Or El Pacino Day, a day that would probably start well and end as an overblown parody of itself. She got it. Great ass! So America's least favorite holiday commemorates a murderous egomaniac whose most famous discovery was a case of getting lost and refusing to ask directions. All of which is enough to make you wonder, Columbus Day, how is this still a thing?